Anyway, I should though. explain wow. about the Phoenix tonight, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it is, it's a French bloke, right? But his English is not very good, so though he's speaking English, we've subtitled him anyway. <laughs> and now it's time for World Cup Phoenix from the Flames. Phoenix from the Flames. So, Patrick, you took part in one of the greatest World Cup games of all time, the France-Germany semi-final in 1982. Uh, that game, it was the classic contrast, wasn't it? Because the, the French, they were all about style, flair and imagination, and the Germans were all about order, efficiency and precision. Yes, before the game, their midfield star Paul Breitner even employed someone to count the air on his moustache. One, two, yep. three, four, five, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, and ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it, that whenever Germany are playing, you always support the other team. I mean, that night, we in England were supporting the French. And as I'm sure you know, we really don't like the French. <laughs> Can't stand the unwashed accordion playing sheep burners. Well, I happen to see the English are a cheesy branch of long ball playing, where they're mentioning homos. <laughs> I still support them when they play Germany. Really, I don't know what I'd do if Germany played Wolves. It's the World Cup the final. It's 1-1. You've just come on as a sub. You're through and about to score. What happened next? I don't know. I was unconscious. <laughs> So, Patrick, what we're going to do is recreate one of the worst fouls in the history of the World Cup. Yes, I lost three tees and broke one vertebrae. <laughs> oh, dear. So what did the referee give? A penalty, sending off, life ban for Schumacher? Not exactly. And we're going to restart with a goal kick. <laughs> God, I'd like to see this incident described in You Are The Ref. Did you say You Are The Ref? That's right. He was the ref. I mean, you are the ref. That comic strip. The forward is approaching the ball on the edge of the area. The goalkeeper tries to kill him. <laughs> What's your decision? Oh, let me see. The goalkeeper completely ignored the ball. The forward is unconscious and bleeding heavily. <laughs> He's in a coma and his spinal cord appears to be sticking out of his back. Goal kick. <laughs> Next week, the shooting of Escobar. Our decision, a drop ball. Anyway, let's do it. Hold on, hold on. I got very badly injured in this incident. We're just going to be doing a silly, gentle little recreation, aren't we? Don't worry, Patrick. I'm only ten and a half stone. I'll be Schumacher. You be Patrick Batterstone, and Dave, you're the ref. Play Gerald Sinstart. Blackney played a great ball for Baggy Stone. No, no, not that Schumacher. 